Zack will move again across the plains, seeking new life and new soil. A sight I have witnessed a handful of times, and am blessed to see again. They move now into the heart of the plains, our ancestral homeland. This is a sign, Wadia. The time has come for the Zeswa to hold the Great Games again. The Great Games? Where alliances are forged and friendships nourished. Other clans have already agreed to participate. And now, I hope, the Saddam too, as well. Ewa calls on us to honor the ways of our ancestors. Join us. We will celebrate our victories and rekindle our traditions. Let us ride the wind! Zakru will be glad to have their friend walk among them. The migration. It's incredible. And as the Zakru moves, so do we. It is a good sign for our great games indeed. You will compete, yes? I don't really know anything about the games. Many your age do not. It has been some time since the last games were held, before the Sky People first spoiled these parts. But now, peace has returned to the plains. So why not joy as well? And a little friendly competition between clans. <laughs> um, it is Zeswa tradition to ride alongside the Zakru by Dire Horse. Join them, my friend. See the mighty beasts up close. Feel the earth tremor as they move with such heavy grace. Trust me, you will not want to miss this. Your Ikran is clever. She will find her own way to our camp as you ride. Minang! The Zakru look beautiful. Are they decorated to celebrate the migration? And the games. The Zakru have led us back to the site of our ancestors' games, held long ago. I feel these games will be most special. Will you take part? Kin asked the same. What kind of games? Those where the songs are made. Fierce trials where Natvi measure their skill and their strength so that all may better serve the people. Yotzahik will be glad to hear you are competing. You mean... Ritnella? She's here? And Telan? Him too. I just saw him helping the dyers in the artisan's tent. Go, Tsamsu. Celebrate with your friends. Tomorrow, our games begin. You've given up on tech, Telan? Oh, hey! You made it! Can you believe every clan is here together? Even the Resistance. Not that they're a clan, but they're here too. Humans and Navi together. And this is Tech, by a different name. Tech? A strange sound. It feels good to say. Tech. Good to see you too, Okul. Are things going well at the Hollows? Very well now. The Gametire have missed you. But the games bring us all together. I look forward to seeing how they will play out. What are you making? It looks good. Die for Rinella. She's here, too, helping the artists paint a huge mural for the games. Hmm. All our colors flowing together, as it once was, as it should be. Join in, if you would like. There are many berries growing around the camp. They make a perfect dye. Yes, I saw the Zeswa using those berries to paint the Zakru, too. I, I can't believe the way they move around. They are so big. So victory should be our theme. We fought and defeated the Sky People. The mural should be about us, the clans, not about the Sky People. We couldn't have won without each other. The theme could be our unity. Ah, 
look who showed up just in time. We overcame our differences. Let our burdens go, healing a divide of many years. And together we found victory. It works. But we must paint it together too. One artist for each clan. We have Zeswa, Sarentu, and Kametire here. But we are missing an Aranehe artist. What about Nifika? I think she would be disappointed to miss out. I saw her climbing the hill, past those friendly sky people. I'm sure she would love to join. I'll let her know. Hey, Anka, you decided to check out the games. We got the invite from Nassim herself. You'd think all Priya's birthdays came at once. I couldn't say no to a little research trip. You gonna compete? Maybe. Right now I'm just looking for Nifika to help out. Have you seen her? Arana Hair Weaver? Long yellow cloak? Ha! <laughs> I know that lady. Hard to miss. And I can still smell the zonke she had with her. She's gone to the top of the hill. Something about views of the past, or friends with a view, or... I didn't really catch what she meant. My auntu, I should have known you would be eager to compete. Planning to fling yourself from these cliffs? I will if you will. <laughs> Child! The games are best as a spectator sport if you ask me. And you should. Sit here, with us. Share the zanke. I think our Sarantu friend is after something a little more exciting than our old stories. Actually, we were hoping you'd help us with the mural. The one to celebrate the games? They have started that already, have they? Come then. Let us see what we can salvage. <laughs> I competed myself in the last games. So long ago, yet the memories are fresh. I feel now as though I am that girl again, full of energy and hope. She did not know darkness. We will make new memories now. It's strange. This reminds me of kin stories. Other paintings like this across the plains, celebrating past games. He has many strange stories. Always kept me entertained, despite my burden. It's beautiful, Ritmela. You know, Minan called you Artsahik. She did? I'm trying to follow her teachings. We all see it. I'm surprised Delan isn't here. He spent so long mixing paint. I thought he'd want to see the result. He was with Kim, last I saw, near the Zakru. The boy seems a little nervous around them. He may need saving. Did I just hear you say you want to move a Zakru? No, I mean, not really. I've been trying out cheese with Kim. It's really good. The boy has an excellent palate. And he said I should try the mature cheese the Zeswa store in the caves. But... But there's a Zakru in the way. Don't laugh at me. They are huge. It's true. Little Nopsy is not so little anymore. I'm not laughing. I get it. And I'll get the cheese. Problem solved, young Talon. You will live to fight another day. Come, join the clans by the fire. You got it! And... The Zakru? Moved with no trouble. They really are gentle. You should get to know them. I'll try. Later. Maybe. Right now I want to hang out here and listen to people's stories. And share some of your own. I heard young Rinella weave in tales already. Come, let us enjoy the fire, my friends. Tonight we are all one clan, but tomorrow all competitors. <laughs> So Sul and I will be cheering you on from our camp, if you want to say hello. When do the games start? At dawn. Anufi is preparing the champions in the main tent, if you wish to join in. Ah. You have prevailed in war. 
but there are no foes to defeat here, only friends. Still, they will test you. May these colors remind your heart of its courage. Lucas, he was cast out. I led by your side, Anufi. Yet now I, I forage for scraps. I have wandered far beyond our forest, hoping for a shared campfire or mere cinders to chase away this unbearable loneliness. Yet none in the clans will have me. Do the games not call us together to set aside all quarrels? Kasa, your absence weighs heavily on my heart. But your betrayal weighs heavier. You chose to smear my hands with the blood that stained your own. I was betrayed myself! Demon, you have shed your false skin. <laughs> you said you came seeking peace. But you were a Ladupin, lurking in the grass, just waiting for your chance to strike. What are you waiting for now? I made mistakes. A fight won't help you here. This human tore you from your mother's arms and you defend her? Solitude has taught you nothing, Mokasa. Our quarrel is not one the games can reconcile. You kept the peace in there, a true diplomat. What should we do? Is Mokasa going to stay for the games? Would you have him stay? The games are for all. It is not my decision. He has no place here. After all that he... Satne, please. This is not something to rush. Maybe Satne is right. There is wisdom in understanding not only what action to take, but also when to take it. <sighs> the games are about to begin. You should join the others for the first race. Take heart and honor this moment, as your people once did. What kind of game is this? A race, warrior. Can you glide like the winds are? Or will you freeze up like a frightened wolf? Do not listen to her. Have fun with it. You would say that. You could not beat my speed. You may be faster, but I scored more targets. Which is more important? A quick shot, or a true shot? It is a race, Sokle. Speed is the point. So, you have to race around the track, on Dire Horse, and shoot targets? Too much for you? The targets are not necessary. But hitting them allows you extra time. That is important. Only if you are slow. Sivako! A little slow, but you were successful. Race again whenever you like. Make a name for yourself among the champions. I am off to try the other games. So let, let us see if you climb as slowly as you ride. <laughs> and who is this brave Zeswa warrior? Huh, very funny. I don't know how you all ride so easily. You get used to it. How was your first bonding with the Dire Horse? Exciting! Feeling her heartbeat, her feet on the grass. I don't know if it was because I was scared or she was scared, but together we were both really scared. I think I'll walk back. The second time is easier. What brought you out here anyway? Oh, I'm looking for something. I mean, I found something. Well, actually, it's both. You know how some of our equipment is really old and finding replacement parts can be tricky? So while we're here, I thought I would look for working tech, and I picked up a radio signal from this base. It's our best shot so far. Could you check it out for me while I scan for more signals? You're not going in yourself? Um, maybe not this time. Surveillance confirms that multiple targets of interest are present at the Zakru migration camp. The residing clans appear to be holding some kind of games event. Targets of interest. Anufi. 
Sahik and de facto leader of the Kamatiri. Previous contact established via previous executive vice president, John Mercer. Dr. Alma Cortez, RDA defector, former administrator of TAP, a high intelligence priority. Are we sure someone's gotten here? Something to access the system. The boss says we shut down until we find out who. You're here! Hey, boo! I've been itching to get some blood on this shield, and I guess you got lucky. It is clear to me. The source of all our troubles is right in front of us. These humans surely stick together. With their machines and recordings sending signals. Hey, now, now listen. We are not stupid, okay? We're not transmitting to anyone. This is not the time for old feuds. It is your shame that makes you hate these humans, Mokasa. They are not responsible. Not for our troubles now, and not for your own. Yet we all know who led the Sky People to us before. Why are you here? To lay blame on everyone but yourself? Does he not deserve the same as me? I share the same blame. But I've been allowed to move forward. The current issue is not with anyone here. We should be focusing our attention on the RDA. Indeed. It matters little why the Sky People have come, but how we react. We should stop the games so as not to draw their interest further. The Zeswa won't be happy. Minang and Nasim are scouting. If they find signs of the RDA as well, perhaps they will feel the same. What? What is going on out there? No. Mokasa? What... what happened? You have been sleeping for days. Some feared you would never wake up. What was that crash? Is everyone okay? Anufi, when I last saw her... Many are hurt. But your actions ensured Anufi's survival. Your Saren two friends made it through as well. Where? I need to see them. They are helping restore the camp. Your resistance friends have also been helping. That human, Alma, she dug me out of the rubble herself. I expected her to run, but she stayed. Perhaps it is simply her guilt that moves her. Can someone responsible for so much death and hate ever redeem themselves? I think, no matter what, it's important to try. This is a Valkyrie. They're... they're reliable. They don't crash. Not like that. Not just dropping out of the sky. Thelan, who was hurt? Where's... Vinela's okay. She's with Minang. Solek and Nasim are out, scouting for the RDA. The Zakru. It killed some of the Zakru. How did this happen? I've checked the engines, the thrusters. I can't find any mechanical faults. Weird. Sid isn't working. I can't hack it. Hmm. Uh, maybe it got bashed about during the crash. Hang on. 
I'll see if I can activate it manually. Harding wants this thing dropped right at the center. Gotta take them all out at once. Loading the hull with explosives? Kind of overkill, don't you think? You kidding? Blues would do the same to us if they had the chance. Target locked. Get ready for evac. Harding? Did they say Harding? She did this? Oh, she's back. She knows where we are. This was on purpose. Why did she come back? Why do they hate us so much? What did we do? This isn't on us, Thelan. Harding has always been cruel and spiteful. You remember what she was like at Tap? She's punishing us. And we got rid of her once. We'll do it again. The Zeswa won't take this lying down. Nella and Minang are with the Zak. They should know the truth. Tread softly. The Zeswa are in mourning. I'm glad you're awake. It was Harding. She targeted the games. Those RDA I saw? They must have been her people. Harding. She lost the planes before. It was her greatest defeat, and perhaps her greatest shame as well. You know she won't give up this time. We need to be ready. Yes, but right now, we are needed here. Among the fallen, Minang will not leave the Zakru like this. She says the proper funerary rites must be performed. The clans have been preparing incense and paint, mourning ribbons to adorn the bodies. I can see if they're ready. We'll honor the Zaku. Together. Ah, good to see you're all right. And you. We are Anahewa lucky. Nafika has joined my father out in the plains, trying to bring... Satne. I'm glad you're okay. You as well, Ma'elan. Your quick thinking saved Anufi's life. Now she is with one of the scouting groups. It seems the Sky People continue to spread over the plains once again, like a fungus. Here, she prepared this incense before she left. A farewell to the Fallen. Will you take it? I am eager to join the hunt myself. Now we can honor them. The spirits of the Zakru run with the Great Mother, while their bodies remain with us. Minang says Atsahik must cherish them. I will try to do as she does. What can I do? Etua said some of the Zakru actually left the camp? Yes. The crash. The tremors it caused. It must have been terrifying for them. None have returned yet. I'd like to help. I'll see if I can find them. The Seam has led her warriors to attack the next camp. I saw Minang with the Zakru at the crash site. The Zeswa must be out for blood. They will have it. Harding is behind this. She's back on Pandora. She's out for blood, too. A gathering like the games made for the perfect ambush. We made it easy for her. No one could have seen this coming, Sotlek. I should have. I dropped my guard. A mistake I would not make twice. We. It looks like there are two RDA camps nearby. One bigger than the other. I'm sure you can handle those. I will look for others. Stay in contact, together. We will ensure the Sky People regret their return. I must say, I'd be curious to see when you'd show up. Roger that! Heading to rendezvous point! Leave with Charlie Command. Samson 1-3 is ready for evac. There are many guards here, but they are sloppy. I have found two ways into the base. If we each take one, we have a better chance of finding Alma and Anufi. We need to be careful. If the alarm is raised, the RDA could kill them. We will be like shadows in the night, unseen, unheard. I will take the unguarded gate at the rear. You are better suited to climbing along the oil pipe. Ah, uh, why's that? Oh, you have younger legs than me. Good hunting. Sotlek, we've just missed Anufi and Alma. They were being interrogated here, and Anufi fought back when Harding tried to move them. Anufi still has fight in her. Good. I overheard many Sky people talking about this place. There is fuel here, and some plan for it. What plan? That I do not know. This corridor leads to the control rooms. Here, 
I can check the computers, see what they're using this place for. But Sotle, what about... I will go after Harding. Sotle, this base is a fueling post for an army. Harding's planning a huge attack. There's more here. Some kind of machinery? I'm going to send this to Daylan, see what he thinks. Do you know how to destroy this place? I think so. I have the schematics. I can bring it down. <laughs> now that is warrior talk. Burn this place to the ground. Are you out? Where are you? Look outside. Harding is leaving, but I'm right behind her. There is another threat. One that would follow us even if we were to leave here. Telan, tell them what you have told me. Right. The RDA have a machine called a Neurosec Scanner. It reads human minds by... Uh, it doesn't matter how. From the data you found, we know that Harding just got one. So, pretty soon, she's gonna know everything Alma knows. About us, about the Resistance, all the clans. Sotlek followed Harding's convoy. They landed just a short time ago. Belan, how long do we have? Hours, if the Neurosec protocols are followed safely. And if they are not, what then? Quicker, but it causes brain damage. The procedure would kill her. Harding won't risk killing Alma before she has all her secrets. You speak only of Alma. What about Anufi? Anufi and Alma share a fate. They were captured together. We will rescue them together. Then I will go too. I did not stop these sky people all those years ago. Now, I have the chance to make things right. Your guilt is not the topic of discussion, Mokasa. You are not a part of this council. Do not presume to have a say in how we should act and when. Harding thinks us beaten and scattered. Our best chance is to attack now. All clans as one. We must gather our warriors. I can go ahead and meet with Salt Lake on the way. Maybe I can stop the machine. Maybe I'll just be a distraction. But either way, it will give you time to attack. We will be close behind. The Sky People will not be prepared for so many of us at once. The base is big and heavily defended. You think they expect us? There has been some movement like this, but no. There has been no alert. You're well armed. After the Valkyrie strike, Rinella asked me to prepare for the worst. She is wise. The Warband will assemble here, and I will lead the attack. Daylan is looking for where the Neurosec could be. In the meantime, I'll see if I can find where they're keeping Alma and Anufi. I will join you soon with the others. Be safe. Ewa Ngahu. Well, Alma, you held out long enough. <laughs> Anufi! She's in the cells. Harding said they're drowning her with oxygen. I'll find her. So, like, can you get Alma out of here? Go. I will clear the way and move her to safety. Sky people's there. One of Harding's favorite punishments. She asked me questions while I drowned in it. Which clans aid the Sarantu? Who are their leaders? She could pry nothing from me. Mokasa? No, 
<laughs> Sky people's metal inside. I never wanted this for you, not this. There might be others coming. Stay here, I'll find a way out. Oh no! Wait, Nella. Harding has a copy of Alma's brain scan. If she leaves with it, we've lost. Where is everyone? They're pursuing the RDA retreat. Is Harding about to take off? Not if I can help it. You know, I told Martha that teaching you cat brats how to hold a gun would bite us in the ass. It sucks to be right all the time. My song is ending, but my last notes will sing true. Anufi, I see you. Truth is all you ever asked of me, but I shrouded you in lies. I lost myself. I am still lost to our people. That loss I caused you. I let pain cloak my heart in darkness. But you found a way to step into the night. Pain cuts deeply, hollows you out. I know you feel this, but your song continues. Mine ends here. I will not see my clan renewed. My shame alone follows me to bear what? Your song now joins the many. It will not be forgotten. We are with you. With us, the Great Mother will know your best self. Sorrow is ended. You are unburdened. Ngari huewa sali, surok mufea sanyam. Mukasa rests with the Great Mother now. And with him, the past slips away. Our path began with his betrayal. And with Harding's death, the last piece of tap is gone. Is it really gone? I still know more human things than Sarin do things. I think we all feel that way. That does not make you lesser. Little by little, you each reclaim what was stolen from you. It is not easy to make a new life from the ashes of your old one. But no, it is possible. 
You are closer than you think. We may not know the ways of our ancestors, but we are not what Mercer and Harding wanted us to be either. We are the new Sarento. We can all be proud of that. 